at that time, Dr. Bedell and Dr. Reich had worked cooperatively between Cornell University and the um, Pasadena um, Laboratories, or Caltech, to develop and build a cathode ray oscillograph. It used a Bell Telephone Laboratories type of tube built by J.B. Johnson. I got pictures of him here later. And um, I got acquainted with that oscillograph there, but found it had some deficiencies at Cornell to limit it so it wouldn't go into high frequencies. Mm -hmm. So, Dr. Bedell and I ordered from Alan Dumont a high vacuum cathode ray tube, and I wrote an article with Dr. Richards and published it in the IRE proceedings uh, in about 1934. I had never met Alan Dumont, so I'll come to how I met him a little bit later. Mm -hmm. Was radio still your orientation, or were you beginning to, uh, to uh, develop an interest and an awareness of television, which was... Well, it wasn't television so much at the start. It was electronic test equipment. A device called an oscillograph has, well, usually a five-inch cathode ray tube about this size, and a voice microphone to pick up the signals. The mm -hmm. pictures come up on this cathode ray tube. So electronic instrumentation, such as mm -hmm. radar mm -hmm. and computers and television, all use that same basic principle. That is, in the older days, it used cathode ray tubes. Mm -hmm. Now, television has gone almost solid state, even to the extent of maybe abandoning the cathode ray tube. Mm -hmm. But uh, in those days, Dr. Bedell had this oscillograph. I was using it one time with this new one I built for him to measure the ripple effect on some x ray equipment. And uh, the professor in charge of that uh, had a 10,000 volt um, power supply, and uh, I got nipped with 3,000 volts of that thing because the wiring was backward, nicked me back across the hall in the <laughs> Cornell University. So I learned to be more cautious with wiring and so forth, but at Cornell I worked, my PhD thesis was in microwaves. I had to build my own magnetron tubes and measure various things in physics with the microwave tubes. Mm -hmm. 